Being a good man and being a nice guy are two very different things. You should be striving towards becoming a good and well-respected man, but you should avoid being a weak little nice guy at all costs. In this video, I will explain to you why being a nice guy will destroy your life. Make sure you watch all the way to the end if you wish to actually understand the concept. Now before we get started, please do me a solid favor and leave a like and hit the subscribe button. I truly appreciate it. Thanks, brother. Now let's get on with it. In today's world of Instagram and social media, a girl is inundated with messages, likes, and comments constantly. While you might assume that being kind to her could make her like you, your attention holds no real value. Your kindness isn't distinctive, as millions of people are already behaving in the same manner online. So how can you make yourself stand out? Numerous girls might overlook you, people may attempt to exploit you, and you may feel hopeless pondering, I'm so nice, what am I doing incorrectly? I always treat people well, but they treat me like a discarded rock on the side of the road. In reality, many men unconsciously fall into the nice guy category. Maybe you or someone you know is consistently behaving as a nice guy. It's not necessarily your fault, whether it's due to growing up fatherless, a female-dominated educational system, an intense wave of feminism, or maybe a combination of these factors. Regardless, the fact that you are watching this video demonstrates that you desire to change and no longer want to be seen as a weak beta male. However, you must understand that the road to change won't be easy. You can't simply put on a facade and deceive women into thinking that you are someone you're not. If you want women to respect you, then you need to become a man who deserves respect. It's as simple as that. Additionally, one of the simplest ways to gain respect is by refusing to tolerate disrespect. Now don't misunderstand me. Being kind to women and people in general is still important. However, being nice has little value because it's a characteristic that can easily be feigned. Almost anyone can put on a pleasant facade, even towards people they dislike. Therefore, it's better to have something that is harder to fabricate, such as status or a luxury car, like a Lamborghini, rather than simply being nice. The issue is that when a man attempts to be overly nice, a woman's instincts kick in, and she may think, we just met, and you're already being so kind to me. Why? This behavior can be a turnoff because it appears insincere and gives off the impression that the man is trying too hard to gain her favor. Nice guys often believe that if they're kind to everyone, they'll eventually receive the same treatment in return. Unfortunately, this is a fallacy. The more accommodating you are at your own expense, the more likely people will take advantage of you. Nice guys tend to be passive and avoid confrontation, even when someone is being disrespectful towards them. This lack of self-respect will only encourage others to disrespect them even more. In contrast, an alpha male is assertive and stands up for himself when someone disrespects him. This behavior commands respect from others, even the person who insulted him, because the alpha male has demonstrated self-respect and conviction. Women seek a sense of security in men who are capable of protecting and defending their honor. Men who are high value understand this fact. By enhancing your status, appearance, and physical health, you will radiate a certain energy that naturally attracts respect from others. You will no longer feel the need to be overly nice to people, seeking validation and approval. Just imagine being the most wealthy and physically fit man in the room. You would naturally exude a strong sense of confidence and self-respect. This energy will attract others towards you, including women. Once you realize your potential as a man, you will be amazed at how much you can achieve. That's it for today's video, brother. I hope you enjoyed it. If you would do me a solid favor and leave a like and hit the subscribe button, it would really be appreciated. And don't hesitate to leave a comment if you have any questions or suggestions. Thanks for watching, brother. I'll see you next time.